Have you had problems with your fans? Have you had unpleasant sensations? Well, today we are gonna fix all those problems with a bladeless fan. We are and not so going to have any unpleasant. What is it called? This is not sponsored by Dyson, by the way. We just thought it looked really cool. Welcome back to What's Inside. I'm Lincoln and this is Dan. And today we have this awesome bladeless fan. Super mysterious. How does a fan work without a blade? Quieter. I think it's pretty funny it says it's 75% quieter. quieter. Blades cause choppy air. The blades on conventional fans chop the air before it hits you, creating an unpleasant sensation. The only unpleasant sensations with air today is gonna be from Lincoln's bum. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't know. Unboxing right here. Let me see that one, two, click. All right, here we go. Um, it has, you basically get it out of the box and you just have this as a one. Let me see that one, two, click. Click. Isn't that a song? No. Ta-da! Look how nice that is. Does that feel pleasant? All right, let's, let's plug it in. I'm excited to see this. We've never actually used one of these things. And then the one we get, we're gonna destroy. Ten. It says ten on it. Do you feel it? It's not choppy! Oh, it's going toward the camera. It's probably like super loud. Is that pleasant? Smells like cardboard. Whoa, that's, that is pleasant. Aw, oh, that feels nice. <laughs> His head's in the fan. You know what they say about when your head hits the fan. Sometimes it just hits the fan. Pleasant air. Like even if we stick this in it, nothing, nothing. It's still blowing air everywhere. Do you feel that in the camera? Do you guys feel that? No, you don't. How can we show that it's blowing air? Here. Pleasant. What is inside of the bladeless fan? How does it make such pleasant air? Would you like a fan that can turn? This is the personal size one, so I think it's like for people in their office. Sometimes people have that problem where you like put your fingers in the fan. I'm not gonna do that. Wait, what? I felt like this was loose. Oh, what? What is that? You can make it point up or down just by sliding it. That is awesome. Sometimes in, with regular fans, when you talk into it, it makes a weird noise. When you talk, it sounds like you have helium. Luke, I am your father. Hello, is it making a weird noise? No. No, you're just talking weird. Oh yeah, I'm just talking weird. Hi, is this a weird noise? No, it doesn't do it. Well, that was fun. Again, we're done with the time lapse. Come on, get up. I'm gonna try taking it apart with my hands a little bit and then once that does not work, I have some tools. Whoa. Here's the inside of the fan. If yeah, you if you like that. look at that and you're just like, wait, that doesn't look like the inside. See that? You can't even see the blades. We're doing something that we don't usually do. We are going to use a screwdriver, but that's because I wanna be able to see this fan functioning still with some of the top layers off of it. Thanks to our friends at iFixit for sending us this toolkit. I fix it! I fix it, but we don't fix it, we destroy it. That's hilarious. The first thing that's coming out is this part right here. It had one screw attached to it. Let's take the second one off. We gotta find the blade. You can't call it a bladeless fan and then have blades inside of it. Wow, that's a long one. Look at that. <gasps> There's the off. fan! I don't know that that's the fan yet. Oh. Where's the fan? Whoa! Okay, all right. Okay. Go down to your mouth. Ow! It's like you're at the dentist. Okay, I am fascinated by this. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? This is the blade. It's not really a blade though. It's this spinning jet thing. Like, see the bottom of it? See that? And the air gets sucked up into there. Take a look inside of there. Nothing really, it's just a little home base for it to sit. So this little jet propeller really does all of it. What happens if we put like something in there, like vegetables or fruit or something? We're gonna put cheese! It is time to cut the cheese. Still don't know what that means. You ever heard that saying before? Let us know in the comments what it actually means so Lincoln knows, okay? Because okay. we're about to cut it. We're gonna rip it. We're gonna sling it! Oh. 
That did not cut the cheese. That cut my pinky. <laughs> I got my pinky in it. Or is it bleeding? No, it looks deep though. <laughs> cut the cheese, take two. <laughs> Stop saying F4. Come on, we just want to cut the cheese. It'll be so great. So we are having some serious problems with this. I'm trying to lift it out because it's not wanting to go. Okay, we've got the base of it out almost. Oh, hey, there we go. All the wires look like they're in the right place. Oh, man. Almost had the cheese. These wires look like they're still in good shape, but the fan is smart enough to know that somebody is tampering with it. This fan spins incredibly well though. Well, now that we have uh, effectively killed the fan, it makes me want to buy another one just so we can cut the cheese. Lincoln loves cutting the cheese. Yeah. It's like his favorite thing. <laughs> That's why this fan's perfect because it's like pleasant air. Okay, here's the top part that spins. It has a little cushiony part that so it doesn't wobble. Broken. I'm sure this is so that it doesn't like rattle around and make noises. And then ooh, that's the motor. We found the actual giant motor. <laughs> Check that out. Let's try it again. You plug it in. Oh! We got it to work! I know! Oh my gosh, but the protective cover is off. Whoa! Do you try to move it? It's like a condom. What are those things that spin those tops? Like a top? Yeah, just top. Okay, it works. But it is very dangerous. Do not try this at home. We gotta cut the cheese. Okay. I, I, got, I got cheese in my eye on that one. Oh my gosh. Wait, is this all cheese? This is all cheese. Look at all this. This is all cheese on the table. That is how you grate the cheese. Cheese. It's cut nicely. Mama's gonna be so happy that all this cheese is all over the place. <laughs> these teeth, it has like these sharp teeth. That, that's what made the cheese come off so well and that's what made part of my finger come off. This is uh, one of the first injuries that we've had in our entire three years of doing what's inside videos. My poor little pinky. That's pretty good for three years of working, but the bladeless fan finally did us in. It has a jet engine inside of it with little blades right there. What do you think cut the cheese means? No. <laughs> I need to clean up this grated cheese before um, Leslie wakes up from her nap and comes down and sees what we did. That was super cool. It's like, it is a bladeless fan. There's no blades, it's just a motor. Very safe fan. Unless you start taking it apart, then it is not safe. It is very unsafe. Super fun, super not sponsored. We just thought this was fun. So <laughs> if you're looking for a fun gift for Christmas for somebody that likes pleasant air, we'll put a link in the description to where we got this. Hi. Okay, here we go, here we go. All right, that is a wrap. Another video done, I like it. Mommy's sleeping.